All right, Treasure Cove with uh, some hints and tutorial. 1992. Rebuild the Rainbow Bridge. Very peaceful game. All right, you head outside and you start looking for orange starfish. And then when you find them, you're gonna press spacebar to catch them. There is one. Answer the question. Went to the beach, dug a hole in the sand. So two. So you, to find the item to go on to the next stage, you have to get all three of the clues to match an animal. So we can guess this one, there's two here. So we know it's not two purple sea, sea snakes. So keep going. Catfish. So two brown. Okay, we're going to the cave. Each stage has a cave in it. There's the last starfish right there. He would be a whale. So we're looking for octopus. So to get to the next level, we need to find two red octopus, but to get the gems, you have to find animals that match two of the three clues. So either two brown, or brown octopus, or two octopus of any color. We'll go cruise around to find them. Now these two brown turtles, we'll find out. Yeah, see, there were two brown turtles. Avoid that thing. So we know the rest of the ones aren't inside the tunnel. Two octopus that are brown. Need one more. Three octopus. Perfect. Now you head back to that little one little area. Let's find this little thing here. You'll come press enter. It'll take you to stage two. You could just get the flounder thing and then just go on immediately, but you want gems to get points, obviously. At the very end, you get a chance to multiply them by two or to double them. So yeah, it really adds up. A seahorse on uh, some sort of shell. And you do it again. Oh, they're all here. Three, right there is three moray eels. Slow down. Oh. When you catch those guys, you just get light, which you use to get more air. I'll show you.
There is no dogfish. So, these could be striped. Yeah, so it's not three striped octopus. Could it, I thought I saw something here that was striped in three. Ah, it's three striped eels. If you can't find your orange dudes, they can hide in here. But this is just like a... It's kind of fun area to be in. Different music. See, he's right here. We'll catch him. Which has four sides. Yep. All the way to the end. See, I'm low on air, so I'll go get more air. It's like an underwater gas station. You give light, you get air. Just around the corner, right here. Five is the number of lights you gotta use. Just keep hitting enter. You tell the crab to fill it up. You get 10 air, I think. All right, let's get the last one. I think it should be in the cave. but I'm gonna just double check. Oh no, those are definitely, oh they're eels in three. Perfect. All right, now you head back to the little area. Because you're underwater, the movement isn't like too responsive, but because you're obviously swimming. It also makes the later game much harder because there's a lot more of those ink things and of a challenge. Oh, here we go. Press enter. If you run out of air and light, the game will give you more. It's not gonna like hard punish you to restart. All right. Stage three, the last, last one. Let's get this start. Oh. Is it two white enemies? No. Or sponges, I forget. Yeah, they can't change directions. In this cave, there's only one animal or one like creature, and it's always right here with the light. If there's not, you get a cool little cutscene like that. striped octopus. Alright, we know what the answer is now. You don't have to catch them, you can kind of just be intuitive. Two, those are two striped moray eels.
Are they striped? Yep. As you get farther along, like the animals kind of change, the colors kind of change, so yeah. And the gems can increase from two like this, and the late game you get to five, so yeah. More to do, more to like explore. All right, let's go finish level three, right here. Put the flounder up, get sucked inside the vortex. In we go. So this is kind of the boss. There's a shark. If you get to the late game, you can get up to four sharks, maybe five. You want to get this gem here. They can't get you right here, so you can always just stand here. You go to the shark if you want to. When it comes at you, hit spacebar to fill him with air. Go here and we'll double our gems. Watch, we'll go hit enter. And then continue on to the final cutscene. Not final, the final is going to beat the game, but... You ride your dolphin back. Good teamwork right there. You get a prize, you got a steering wheel for a ship, whatever that thing's called. Get your points. And rinse and repeat. Most games take between like 8 to 15 minutes depending on how late in the game you are, or how fast you are, or how fast you want to push yourself, but it's a fun game. <laughs>